This bunker is so surreal. <sighs> this is too heavy to break, so I'll need a code. I guess the Prescotts were just born bastards. Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies. I wish Warren could have seen that physics trick. Watson, we can safely assume that this ancient vehicle is not our suspect. Watch us. This tractor has paid its dues. Now that's a serious door. Where's Gandalf when I need him? First a padlock, then a digicode? Someone really doesn't want visitors. Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies.
the only reason to build a secret bunker under- <sighs> Wrong code. didn't work. Oh, yes! I thought that only worked in the movies. Open sesame. Stocked and ready for the apocalypse. This must have cost a fortune. Come on. Now what the hell is this? Whoa. This says it all about Nathan. He needs help. Prescott's in creepy art. Come on, let's see what this shit is all about. We are. Okay, a binder marked Victoria, but it's empty. Look, the next one says Kate. Oh no, Kate. No. God, I should have killed that bastard back there. Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. <sighs> Victoria has to be next. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex Club party. Rachel. This can't be real. These are all, these are all post shots, right? Right? Chloe, look at her face. She's out of it. Maybe, maybe Nathan paid her a shitload of cash to do this. She probably would have. I don't think so. Why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Th then we can see what he did. There's no way she's dead. No way. She posed for those pictures, Max. I know it. Please, let's go. Oh my god, Rachel, Kate, all of these vials. This place actually feels evil.
Everybody, slow down! Wait for me! I know exactly where I'm going! Look, this is it! This is it! Are you gonna help me, Max? Chloe, stop! Look. Please, no. Oh, oh that smell. Rachel. Oh. I hope Nathan enjoys his last party. Chloe, we can go right to the cops. We have proof. Fuck the police. Rachel wanted us to find her. So we could get real justice. And revenge. The Prescotts have had this coming for a hundred years, and nobody is gonna get in my way. Especially with your help. Right? I'm with you to the end, Chloe. You know that. I can't tell if they're different. What is that? that? Can't be too Jesus, moved. Chloe, look up at the sky. Possible. Beautiful. I don't give a shit. The world is ending. Cool. You're not listening. Something major is going down. That's right. Nathan Prescott is going down. Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. I'm glad you decided to escort me. You look really good, Warren. Are you alright after today? I'm glad you stopped me. Nathan is dangerous. Where is he? I didn't see him at the dorm again. I was held up in my room. Dude, have you been drinking? <laughs> well, if you consider half a beer drinking... Let's go, Max. Hey, hey. I know this is a bad time, but can I get one picture? I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so I want to have something for prosperity. Well, I don't blame you, Warren. I know, I know. I'm pain in the booty. Just one picture. Uh. Action. We've got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Sorry. I just wanted to feel like a normal student after this week's ultra-violence. 
I never hit anybody like that before. I was always the one getting my ass kicked. Hey, we still need your expert help. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. He won't. I know how to be invisible here. Not to me, Warren. Text soon. Members only, okay? I don't give a shit about being a member. I just want to talk Victoria to Victoria specifically told me not to let you in. Nice try. Too bad you're not a member. Listen! No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. I need to find a way to enter this bullshit club. Yes, 
You've been vomiting for like an this hour. This is my last Vortex Club party. Oh, Maybe no. you're not the only not one again. happening here today. Oh. Hey, don't wrap it up. Yo, maximum overdrive. About time you got here to save this lame rave. Wanna get ripped? Uh, you look pretty ripped already, Justin. And not happy. Why did you even come tonight? Where else could I go in Arcadia Bay on a Thursday night? Besides, Dana is here. She's not with me. So yes, this party sucks. Speaking of, have you seen Nathan? Oh, he should be freaking out in the VIP lounge with that whore Tex club. I fucking hate those snobby douchebags. Especially Nathan. That dude is gonna go on a rampage soon. You might be right, so stay away from him tonight, okay? Spread the word. Max, I know I'm twisted, but your face looks so fucking intense. And your voice sounds different. You okay? How about a quick dab? Uh, no, I'm, I'm cool, Justin. And I have to get going. Maybe you should go chill somewhere else. Fucking A, Maximus! You're right. I'm only torturing myself here. Plus, I'm too loaded. It's time to get my board and grind. Vortex Club party. I know. This week was so shitty that I just wanted to be around a bunch of people trying to have a good time. Even if I hate most of them. Victoria doesn't seem to hassle you like she does me. Or Kate. She must know I'd punch her in the face. I probably should just for like posterity. Alyssa, I have to find Nathan. Have you seen him? I really don't know, but surely in the VIP section, like it's a New York club. Thanks, Alyssa. Watch out for yourself. Why, when I have Max Caulfield at my side? Good luck. Yes, you do so. Apparently, Blackwell has a severe toilet paper fetish. I can drink more later. Somebody's either having sex or throwing up. Or both. Ugh, gross. How did this even get here? I'd like to tear every one of these things down.
you're the only person I don't mind seeing right now. I was looking for Nathan. I've avoided almost everybody here tonight. Uh, why are you looking for Nathan? I want to make sure he's not gonna do anything tonight. Like what happened to Kate. I have dreams that somebody finally kicks his ass one day. Luke, sometimes dreams come true. Today I saw Warren give Nathan an epic headbutt. Yes, give it up for Brother Warren. Now all we have to do is drive all these goddamn Prescott vampires out of town. I think Sean Prescott wants to drive all of us out of town. Or into Pan Estate. I met him once at a Bigfoots game. Mean fucking bastard. Oh man, he explains Nathan. Preach it, Brother Luke. Okay, I have to get going. Um, thanks for seeing me. No, thank you. So for helping Kate. And for keeping it real. Peace out. Bigfoot on otter action. doing at a vortex club party <laughs> it really must be the end of the world <laughs> get it but seriously like what do you want i didn't want to be alone tonight after this week so i thought it'd be nice to hang out in the vip section yes it is very nice if you're in the vortex club which you're not and will never be so excuse me great plan max Time to find another way into the VIP section. Blackwell is having a party after Kate almost jumped off a roof. I guess people are happy that Kate is okay now and they can party again. I'm just happy she's drawing again. She seems much better and her mother is being so supportive for a change. Kate deserves that. Kate deserves revenge. We have to make sure this doesn't happen to anybody else at Blackwell. I can tell you know some serious shit by your face. You don't have to tell me now, but please let me know if I can help, like you helped me. No doubt. Um, but I actually have to go now. I'll talk to you later, Alyssa. Thanks again, Max. Now I can enjoy this shitty party. You can't come in. What are you doing in here? No, seriously, I'm out of here. Oh, and everything isn't so fuzzy.
you at a Vortex Club party. I didn't expect that either, but I really need to find Nathan. Have you? No, I haven't seen him. And I'm not looking for him, so I most likely won't tonight. I just hate that scrub. And his club. So why are you here tonight? No homework? Boredom? Waiting? Have you seen Warren tonight? Why? You're the one going out with him. Brooke, enough. I, I am sorry Warren asked me to the meeting, but you don't need to give me an attitude. I'd like to think I'm your friend. I know. I get salty when things don't go my way. I'm selfish while you go on a roof to help save your friend. You're not selfish, Brooke. You're just trying to live your life without all this bullshit. Like all of us here. You seem so wise. Kind of invincible this week. I think that snow and eclipse gave you superpowers. Check to see if you can fly. Only with your drone. By the way, did you see that crazy double moon out there earlier? Max, if I saw a double moon out there, I would assume it really was the end of the world. Well, the night is still young, huh? And so are we, Max. So let's plan a drone date next week. All eyes on me up in here. Search your other station, but teach you to the rear. When I'm in the room, why your team disappear? Bad girl, let the speed in your ear. I'm a naughty little girl, and I give them what they need. Hit them with that tight work, switching up the speed. Tell the DJ, stop switching up the beat. Volume too loud, can you get it up for me? Get my swag, don't get them. Lames don't fill them. Broke dudes, broke dudes, won't deal with them. If I really want them, all I gotta do is get them. And it's not even a problem. I'm so not impressed by this VIP crap. Party. Don't stress, Courtney. I'm still getting into the VIP section. sick now I can drink more no seriously I'm out of here oh and everything isn't so fuzzy Chloe must be around So 
Somebody's either having sex or throwing up. Or both. Ugh, Max. is the Vortex Club, so his ass has to be here tonight. Sorry, Max. Vortex Club members only. Sorry. I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, Miss Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. You still pissed about me taking your picture? Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh tried to kill herself in front of you. And me. Everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. I blame Nathan for dosing Kate, but nobody at that party even cares she was so wasted. It's a fucking party! Everybody is wasted! What do you want from me? Some humanity, Victoria. Well, you got Nathan busted out of Blackwell, so you should be happy. And I'm the only person here who cares what Nathan is going through. This is bigger than a problem, child. I'm not perfect, okay? I'm a teenager at an art school. I'm only here to become a photographer and get famous. You have talent, Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's, it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way, and, and he's famous. Yeah, Mr. Jefferson probably won't be choosing my photo. I'm not as talented as I thought. Yes, you are. But we shouldn't have to choose between talent and kindness. I hope. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. Do you think it's like fate we're not supposed to be friends? Yes, you're about to start a riot. Like that, I'm about to just burn it away. Give it a waste to start a new day. It's all 
Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? Whoever makes that decision, that would be us, Victoria. Well, Max Caulfield, I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. I don't think that's going to happen, but not for the reasons you think. Oh, you look so serious. Victoria, enough of this high school bullshit. We're adults now, so listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know you're close to Nathan, but he's truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at his party to the beach eight percent. Dark. Oh my god. And I'm the drama queen? Touche. But I am not fucking around here. Sorry, but no. No way. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not. You have to believe. I don't believe anything you said. You're full of shit. Oh, hi, I'm Max Caulfield, and I'm so sensitive that butterflies make me cry. Now, will you listen? No, I won't. You're just pissed because you didn't enter a photo in the contest and that Mr. Jefferson is going to pick me. A real artist would have busted ass to win, but you just want to take your little retro selfies. That is so fucking lame and lazy, Max. Just go find a community college. <gasps> Victoria, please don't do this. Especially after what happened with Kate. Can't you see I'm serious? That's your problem, Max. This is a party, and it's the end of the world, so I am going to get so wasted, even you won't bother me anymore. I'll let Nathan know if he finally shows up. Adios. Au revoir. Okay, I tried. She's not gonna believe me over her Vortex Club partner. There you are. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the locker. Damn. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it, Max. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. <laughs> are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just... Looking for Nathan. Uh huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the uh the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost on. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. Okay, okay, everybody calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, look, I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. Now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. The envelope, please. And the winner is... Oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Oh my god! Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. It was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. <laughs> she is the real everyday hero of Blackwell, and I can't wait for her to come back.
Thank you. You suck, Victoria. <laughs> Victoria won. Thank you, Victoria. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Yes, I can. Who fucking cares? Those two are still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass. Now! Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Oh Christ, Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard right now. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. to be quiet. We could die, okay?
Oh. 